Yeah, I did have trepidation because of Vietnam. Uh, you know, it's hard for me to think of Lyndon Johnson. Well, for most people, that's true, without thinking about Vietnam. So, uh, he, understandably, I was not, you know, when he first asked me about playing him, I was a little bit like, oh, I really got to think about this one. Because there's some real moral ambiguity here. And, uh, yeah. you know, but in the end, I, I found him so fascinating. You know, I just started reading books and just different things about him and, and listening to his phone calls, which he taped all of his phone calls. So. Did he really? Yeah, yeah, anybody here could listen to LBJ talking about a variety of subjects, and he's 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 an amazing guy. And tell um, him tell him what he said to uh, Nixon, who who uh, took the Oval Office. Yeah, he also <laughs> taped all his phone you know, calls. Yeah, he said, you know, make sure you tape your phone calls. Really? <laughs> and, and of course, it was Nixon's undoing, so he just. <laughs> You got to get shot in on the way out the door. Well, that's um, what you know. That's the, the famous quote right now that Obama said to Trump going in was like, make sure you talk to your lawyers. <laughs> <laughs> it's like on his way out. Yeah. Yeah. Well, he, he sure needed to do that. So. 